Hi, I'm Scientist Cindy. Let's explore the circulatory system. The function of the circulatory system is to circulate blood throughout the body. The circulatory system includes the heart, the blood, and the blood vessels. The heart functions to pump the blood through the blood vessels. The heart does this by creating a pressure gradient that forces the blood to travel through the body. The blood has four components, red blood cells, white blood cells, platelets, and plasma. The red blood cells carry oxygen to the cells of the body. The red blood cells also will carry away carbon dioxide from the cells. The deoxygenated red blood cells then return to the heart. The heart will then give these cells the push needed to travel to the lungs. The red blood cells then travel to the lungs where they release their carbon dioxide and receive oxygen. The oxygenated red blood cells then return to the heart to get another push before making their way around the body. The blood also contains white blood cells that fight infection and keeps us healthy. Blood plasma carries nutrients to the cells and carries away waste products. The platelets in the blood are clotting factors that act to stop the bleeding from wounds. The function of the blood vessels is to provide the network of passageways that allows the blood to travel throughout the body. There are two major types of blood vessels, arteries and veins. Arteries carry blood away from the heart and veins carry blood toward the heart. The blood circulates around two loops, the pulmonary circuit and the systemic circuit. The pulmonary circuit brings the blood from the heart to the lungs and back to the heart. The systemic circuit brings blood from the heart to the rest of the body and back to the heart. The systemic circuit brings blood from the heart to the rest of the body and back to the heart.